From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Wednesday, April 6, 2016. Leading our update, emergency responders were notified of a deceased person in downtown Fairbanks just before noon yesterday. The lead investigator of the incident says that no foul play is suspected. Officer David Elsey says the body of 25-year-old Peter Lee James was found on a bench along the Chena River across from Golden Heart Plaza. Elsey said it's likely that James died of hypothermia while trying to sleep on the bench. The exact cause of death will be determined by the state medical examiner's office. At 9.45 Monday night, state troopers stopped a pickup for speeding near mile 67 of the park's highway. But according to the report, the male driver tried to pepper spray the officer, then sped off in the truck. During the chase, the female passenger took control while the male started throwing heavy tools and other items at the pursuing trooper vehicle. Spike strips were eventually used and the apprehended pair were identified as 25-year-old Logan Austin and 23-year-old Sandra Austin of the Fairbanks area. Both were jailed without bail. And following the announcement of two squadrons of F-35s coming to Eielson Air Force Base, we learned that Eielson's commander will be leaving Alaska. Colonel Michael Winkler, commander of the 354th Fighter Wing and Eielson Air Force Base, will be assigned to Japan following his nomination to Brigadier General. Winkler will be away from the hustle and bustle scheduled for Eielson in the coming years. He says he's both excited for the opportunity in Japan, but sad to miss the preparation phases in and around Eielson. Quick look at the Fairbanks weather. Today, increasing clouds, highs upper 40s to lower 50s. Tonight, mostly cloudy with lows in the mid-20s. Then tomorrow, mostly sunny with highs in the lower 50s. Extended outlook, mostly cloudy through Saturday, partly cloudy after that. Highs 45 to 50, lows 25 to 30, and the aurora forecast is moderate. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. And remember the KTVF Summer Activity Fair coming Saturday, April 16th, 11 to 4 at the Big Dipper Ice Arena. Learn more at webcenter11.com. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.